Hey, hello, I'm back. This is my day after unboxing. I just set up my Marshall amp. I got it set now for a lot of crunch. Everything's all the way up. The reverb's all the way up. The volume's way down. Almost at nothing. And this tap manual light means that uh, the effects are however you left them according to this knob. If you want, or, or, or the knobs are however you left them. But let's see, to use the effects, you hold that down until that store light is solid. And if you have a foot pedal, you can control your stored effects. But for right now, I'm not gonna use the effects, except for the reverb. Which is almost all the way up. All right. We'll hear how good it sounds. Maybe not as good as in my garage. But, uh, well, definitely not as good as in my garage. But perfect for a living room.
Okay, now how about a little more effects on there, huh? Well, let's see. Let's see. I know you want some effects every now and then. So let's go ahead and press this tap button until that store light stays solid. And let's hear the same thing with some phaser. That means I'm cranking the phaser all the way up. And that means I'm cranking the flanger all the way up, as far as I know. Let's try it with the phaser. Or I'll try a different one with the phaser. Okay. Yeah, I'll take it the same time. Mm. Well, it's not nearly as loud now, but the phaser's... You know, this effect's called the phaser, and I thought it wasn't working right at first because I had the volume, I had the gain all the way up on the uh, crunch channel, and without the effects, and the volume turned way, way down, and then when I turned the effects on, I had to turn the volume up a little That's called a phaser.
Okay, that's a flanger. I kept messing up. I'm gonna try it again on a different effect. Or that's a phaser. Uh. Alright, now here's that was a phaser. Like almost all the way up. Now here's a flanger.
trying some uh, different effects here. Let's see. Like, what do you want here? Clean out up. Let's try one more effect. That was the, uh, was the flanger all the way up. The chorus is pretty good. How about some delay? You know, that octave, I'm not sure how the octave works exactly. Okay, well the delay makes sound like this right now, so I think I'll clean the tone up a little and then put the delay on. I just uh, lowered the gain. It's still on crunch. I just lowered the gain and turned up the volume on. And put it on delay. Change the delay of the word.
Okay, I'm gonna clean it up this time. No, no delay on that. That delay. I just like the reverb better than that delay. I just like the plain reverb better. The delay sounds, you know, it's a little punchy. Like, 
Pum, 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 pum. That's like the uh, reverb sound. It throws me off a little. I'm not used to electric. Now this is a chorus. Oh, that sounds really nice, yeah.
Okay, now this time we're just gonna put it back on clean uh, with the overdrive. I'll put just put it on the overdrive this time. First, I'll turn down the master. Okay, now this is the Overdrive 2. Let's finish up. With uh, no no effect. It well, was the chorus. Okay, now see that rocks. You see what I'm saying? It's just a master reverb. It's just a Marshall reverb with just an overdrive, the master. The master's turned up about a quarter way. The volume's turned up about a quarter way. The gain's turned all the way up. So cool, man. Check check with me later. Maybe I'll learn some more about my amp. It's only been uh, one night.